to the rescue! And then the firefighters put the fire out and rescued the entire town. The end. Wow! Firefighters are real heroes! We should be firefighters. Then we could be heroes, too. <laughs> okay. Well, who are we gonna rescue? Hmm. I know. I'll go ask Mom if she needs to be rescued. Hey, Mom. I'm a firefighter. Do you need to be rescued? Hmm. Not really. But you could help me water the garden. Mom. <laughs> I mean, like, a big rescue. Like, putting out a fire. Oh, I see. Well, there aren't any fires to put out, but I'll let you know if I see any. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> so does your mom need our help? Nope. And it doesn't look like anyone around here needs to be rescued. <gasps> That's it, Squidgy. Let's go to the fire station. Vroom, vroom. Hop on, Squidgy. Oh, oh, I'll turn on the siren. Justin. Hi, Squidgy. Welcome to San Francisco Fire Station number one. Whoa! What a cool siren! What a cool fire truck! Thanks. I need them both to be a firefighter. <gasps> Can we be firefighters too? Sure. Follow me into the firehouse. To be a firefighter, you always need to be ready. Ready for a big rescue! Big or small? We are ready to rescue them all. But first we'll need to put on our... Ready! Perfect, you've got your fire helmets. Now follow me. <laughs> I'm going to show you the most important tool in the firehouse. A phone? Right, when the phone rings, it tells us where our next rescue is. It's rescue time, Squidgy! A call! San Francisco Fire Station. We'll be right there. Come on, someone needs our help. We'll take the fastest way down. A fireball! Whee! 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 <laughs> I'll drive. I'll ride on the back. I'll crank the siren! Good and loud, Squidgy. Oh. Right up. I know. We can fill up the pond with the fire hose. Good idea, Justin. Don't worry, we'll save your ducklings. Squidgy, no! Look out! Whoa! I got it! Justin! I'll save you, Squidgy! <laughs> That's better. Now let's aim it at the pond. Good rescue, team. Yep, those are some lucky duckies. That was fun, but it wasn't a really big rescue. <laughs> let's get back to the station and see if we get any more calls for help. Yeah, let's go! Bye-bye, <laughs> Ducky! Bye! Ooh. 
Hey guys, do you want to play a game while we wait for the next call? Sure, how about checkers? Checkers, I love checkers, I'm red. Okay, Squidgy, it's your move. Hmm. Another call! I bet this time it's a really big rescue. San Francisco Fire Station, we'll be right there. Let's go, someone else needs our help. Squidgy, this one's a really big rescue! I can feel it! The biggest rescue ever! <laughs> What's wrong, little girl? Cuddles. Oh, I like cuddles too. <laughs> Squidgy, this is Susie. And Cuddles is Susie's cat. Oh, Cuddles! He's stuck in that tree. Cuddles. Don't worry, Susie. We'll get Cuddles down for you. He's pretty high up. We'll have to use the ladder. Here, Cuddles. Come on, kitty. Cuddles? I need to be a little higher. Okay, hold on. How's that? A little higher. More? Perfect. Cuddles! Ah! Ah! Cuddles is so cuddly. Good work, team. Yeah, helping ducks and kittens is great, but I want to go on a big rescue and be a real hero. Sometimes it's a big rescue, sometimes it's a not-so-big rescue. Let's get back to the station. Bye, Susie. Bye, Cuddles. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> it's rescue time! San Francisco Fire Station. <gasps> There's smoke coming from Granny Lombard's house. They said to hurry. This is it, Justin. To the fire pole! Sure. I hope Granny Lombard is okay. Hold on, everybody. Whee! Whee! Okay, team. This is it. Time to be heroes. <laughs> Are you okay? Olive, you're here. And it's so swell that you brought some of your friends. Hacha, 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 cha. Hacha, 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 cha. But there's smoke coming from your backyard. Why, of course there is. It's my 100th birthday. <laughs> the smoke is coming from your birthday cake. Hey, the duckies are here. And Susie and Cuddles, too. It's everyone we rescued today. Cuddles! <clears throat> My hero. Oh, uh, thanks. Well, it seems you helped out a whole bunch of people. That makes you heroes in my books, too. Well, we did make a lot of little rescues, mm -hmm. but we didn't get to do a really big rescue. You mean a fire? I do have a cake with 100 candles on it. I could use some help blowing them all out. <laughs> Go for it, Justin. <gasps> Justin, can I put out this one? Go for it, Squidgy. <gasps> you did it! Justin! Come on, Squidgy! Mom needs our help! Bye, Olive! Bye, everyone! Bye, Justin. Goodbye, Justin! Thank you! Bye-bye!
Squidgy, I bet Mom's flowers need our help. Right. I'll get the hose ready. Hey, Mom. I'm here to rescue your flowers. Why, thank you, Justin. They could use some water. Firefighter Justin to the rescue! My hero. Pit Crew Hullabaloo! Come on, Squidgy! The race is about to start! Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Drivers, start your engines! Vroom! On your mark, get set! Hey! <laughs> Ah, uh, flat tire. Hmm, I think this car might need to see a doctor. Maybe your dad can help fix it. No, I don't need any help. It's not that flat. We can still win the race. Come on, Squidgy, let's go! Vroom! This has to be the coolest place ever! It is! Olive! Hi, Justin. Hi, Squidgy. Welcome to England. You're at Brooklyn Speedway. Whoa! Look at him go! He's practicing for the big race that's about to start. Is that the fastest car, Olive? Maybe. But my car's pretty fast, too. No way. Is that your car, Olive? It is. I'm a mechanic. That's like a doctor for cars. Cool, a car doctor! Who's the driver? I'll drive your car. Yeah, Justin's the best driver ever! Perfect. Now all we need is a name. Let's call it Blue Lightning! Blue, Blue Lightning. Lightning! Nice! Oh, oh! Can I ride with Justin? I can honk the horn. I'm so good at honking. Listen! Honk, honk! Squidgy's a really good honker. <laughs> Sorry, Squidgy. A race car only has room for the driver. Why don't you be in the pit crew with me? Sure! Uh, what's a pit crew? A pit crew helps keep a race car in tip-top shape. Oh, that sounds like fun. Can I use a horn? You bet. Here. <gasps> I'm in the pit crew! <laughs> <laughs> and I get to drive Blue Lightning. Sounds great, Olive. It sure does. But you'll have to make sure you make pit stops during the race to keep it that way. What's a pit stop? A pit stop is when you come back here during the race to keep your car in tip-top shape. Justin, when you hear Squidgy's horn, it's time for a pit stop. It sounds like this. <laughs> I'll hold up a sign to show you why you're stopping. This one means time to stop for gas. <laughs> This one means time to stop for oil. And this one means time to stop for new tires. Right. So when you hear that and see a sign, just come over to the pit lane and pull into our blue garage. Got it. Drivers, please make your way to the starting line. The race will commence momentarily. I'd better get going. Wish me luck. Good, Good luck, luck, Justin. Justin. Right! Are you 
thirsty, Justin? No time now, Olive. I've got to get back out there. Don't worry. The other drivers all have to make pit stops, too. Every car needs gas. Okay, all filled up and ready to go. Thanks, pit crew. You're the best. Woohoo! They'll never catch me. Pit, pit, on your side. On me. Wow, those were quick pit stops. Excuse me. Coming through. After a jolly good pit stop, everyone's back in the race. Red Storm is now in the lead with Yellow Hornet close behind and Blue Lightning pulling up the rear. Look out! Young chap, I'm still in the lead. Not for long. Coming through. Jolly good show. Woohoo, I did it. Justin and Blue Lightning have taken the lead again. Yeah. Excuse me, sir. We'd like to pass. Try and pass me if you can. Not a problem. Take the lead. I need a pit stop too? Not now. Hurry, pit crew. I need to get back out there. Don't worry. Red Storm will need an oil change too. Cheerio. Oil, please. Oil. Pit stop. Hmm. Huh? Don't worry, Justin. Your trusty pit crew's here to help. Yeah, let's get Blue Lightning back to the pit stop. New tires are good. You're ready to go. Sorry, pit crew. I should have let you change the tires before. That's okay. The race isn't over yet. Great. I need your help so I can win this race. Squidgy, how's the gas? Gas is a okay. Olive. Has the oil. Oil is good. Blue lining is in tip top shape. Looks like we've got some catching up to do. But you're good to go, Justin. Thanks, pit crew. You're the best. Absolute race, young chap. Surely good show. I couldn't have done it without my helpful pit crew. 
And we couldn't have done it without our amazing driver. Justin! That's my dad. We'd better go. Bye, Olive. Bye, everyone. Thanks for everything. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Cheerio. Ta-ta! Hmm. That tire is really flat. Mm-hmm. I think Dad should be part of my pit crew. Hey, Dad! Can you help me fix my pedal car? It has a flat tire. No problem, Justin. I can fix that for you. There. You're all set. Have fun. Thanks, Dad. Ready to go, Squidgy? Ready to go! <laughs> Drivers, start your engines! <laughs> I didn't mean to wake you. Oh, that's okay, Justin. What was that noise? I'm building the Tower of Justin. But it keeps falling down. The Tower of Justin? Oh, I love building things. Can I help? What's the plan? How are we gonna build it? We're going to make it tall, Squidgy. Really tall. Oh, that's a great plan, Justin. <laughs> Okay, I'll do this. And we get up there. Nope, up the top. A little more. There! Oh. Whoa! Oh. Mm. Why does it keep falling? Well, maybe there's something wrong with these blocks. You know what we need, Squidgy? Real builder stuff like drillers and movers. And pushers and lifters! Right! Then I could build a super tall tower. Higher than this room, Justin? As high as the sky! Wow. Morning, Justin. Morning, Squidgy. <laughs> Olive. Olive! Welcome to New York City! Justin, look at all that construction! They sure have tall buildings here. Yep, they're so tall, they scrape the sky. So we call them skyscrapers. Skyscrapers, ooh. Let's build our own skyscraper, Olive. Great idea. We can call it the Tower of Justin. Yeah, let's get started. Wait a second. First, you'll need these to keep you safe. Hard hats! And I've got everything else we need right over there. Whoa, big, humongous building blocks. Super humongous. But how are we going to lift them? Easy. With these hooks and those cranes. Cranes? <gasps> Squidgy, we get to use cranes! I love cranes! Woohoo! Okay, Justin, what's the plan? To build as tall as we can! <gasps> can I use the orange crane? Sure, Squidgy. And I'll use the blue crane. And I'll take care of things here on the ground. <laughs> Block number one is in position. Nice work, Justin. Next one's ready, Squidgy. Take her away. <laughs> Nicely done, Squidgy. Maybe I... <laughs> yep, something's wrong with the blocks. You're right, Squidgy. The block looks tilty. Hang on. Oh, I get it. The blocks are okay. It's the ground that's the problem. Come over here and look. We're building on a big, lumpy bump of dirt. We should have moved it out of the way first. That's a lot of dirt to move. 
Not if you have the right equipment. Ah! Giant dirt movers! They're called bulldozers. Squidgy, you can have... I get the orange one! I get the blue one! Let's go! I'll lift the block. All right, let's move that big, lumpy bump of dirt out of the way. Wow, this is a lot of dirt. Coming back for more. Wow, this is a lot of dirt. Hmm, this big, lumpy bump of dirt doesn't seem to be getting any smaller. Oh, well. Huh? huh? Hey! Squidgy! Oh, hey, Justin! What you doing? I'm moving the big, lumpy bump of dirt. Hey, I'm moving the big, lumpy bump of dirt, too. There sure is a lot of it, huh? Squidgy, we're just moving the same dirt back and forth. <laughs> oh! Maybe we should have planned this a little better. I think we need to move the dirt away from here. Yeah, good idea, Justin, but where? Hey, guys, just load that dirt into my dump truck. Good, good thinking, thinking, Olive! Well, that's that. Good and flat. Now we're ready. Let's get building! Right. Justin, does the tower look funny to you? It does look a little tilty, Olive. <gasps> I don't get it. We made the ground all flat. And we have all the right equipment. And these are all the right pieces. This isn't going according to plan. Um. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll have to start over again. Uh, Justin, I'm getting hungry. Me too, Squidgy. I guess it's time for our... Lunch break! <laughs> so, what's for lunch? We're making sandwiches. Are those pickles? I love making sandwiches. Me too. Me three! Mine will be the biggest sandwich ever! Mine will be the crunchiest sandwich ever! Oh, I love pickles! Huh? Phew. This is gonna be so yummy! There! Done! Huh? Whoa! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, now that's a sandwich! Thanks! How did you make it so tall? Easy. I started with the biggest thing, and then I added the medium-sized pieces, like the meat and cheese, and then I put the smallest thing on top, like the pickle. That is the perfect place to put the pickle. Wait, Squidgy, that, that's it. That's how we're going to build it. We'll build our tower like a sandwich. Uh, I don't think we have enough pickles. <laughs> That's not what Justin means, Squidgy. I mean we should put the big pieces on the bottom, then the medium pieces in the middle, then the little ones go on top. Now that's a plan. Is everybody ready to build the Tower of Justin? Ready. Big pieces first. Got it! <laughs> are stacked in place. Great job! And now, the medium pieces for the middle! Going up! Up, up, up! Now let's finish up the middle. Yeah! Tall. It's scraping 
the sky! We did it! All we needed was a plan. Big at the bottom, medium in the middle, small on top, and one more thing. That's my dad calling. Time for us to go, Olive. Okay. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Bye, Olive. Wow. Hey, that's some tower, Justin. Thanks, Dad. Dinner's almost ready. Make your own sandwiches. Yeah. We'll pile them high to the sky. <laughs> that sounds like a plan. Come on. Wait, Justin. One last thing. The perfect place to put the pickle. <laughs> <laughs> the Pancake Express. <laughs> toot, toot. Hey, why did it stop? It needs more power, Squidgy. I just need to wind it up some more. Is it ready yet? Just one more turn and... Uh. <gasps> oh, no! The wind-up key went down the vent! Let's go get it! Uh-oh. I don't see it anywhere. I think it's gone, Squidgy. What are we gonna do, Justin? I wish we had a real train. Yeah. A real train would be great. Yeah! You be the driver! Okay. All aboard! Off we go! Oh! Now that's a tutor! Squidgy! We're on a train! Awesome! Look, Squidgy! A station! And there's Olive! Hi, Olive! Olive! Justin! Squidgy! Welcome to Canada! Wow, it's beautiful! Morning, Olive! What's up? I have to deliver a batch of maple syrup to Flapjack Falls for the Pancake Festival, and I'm already late! Well, you're in luck! We're the fastest train on the railroad! We'll get you there lickety-split! Great, I'll load you up. Mm, I love maple syrup, and I love pancakes! <laughs> I love pancakes too, Squidgy. Wow! Mmm, maple-licious! <laughs> Pretty good, eh? Our maple syrup is the best. How far is Flapjack Falls, Olive? Not far, but we don't want to be late. All aboard! Oh no, the train's broken. <laughs> Even my tutor's out of toots. That's because we're out of steam. We need to feed the furnace. What do you feed a furnace? Pancakes? <laughs> no, Squidgy. Coal. Oh, well, we've got lots of coal. First, you feed the furnace with some coal. The coal burns. Hey, it's heating the water. Right. Then the water turns to steam. The steam makes the wheels go. <laughs> <gasps> Hooray! My tutor's got its tune back. I'm really rolling now. We'll be in Flapjack Falls in no time. Mm, pancakes. <laughs> 
like mine with extra butter and maple syrup and cream cheese and hazelnut spread and marshmallow sauce? <sighs> Justin, there's a moose blocking our tracks. Wow! I've never seen a moose before. He's big. Hey, that moose is sleeping. We have to wake him up. And soon. Otherwise, we'll miss the Pancake Festival. <gasps> miss the festival? Nuh uh, no way. Uh, how will we wake him up? We need something really noisy. Hmm. Like. like a. Oh, like my tutor? Yeah, your tutor! Cover your ears! Hi. Sorry to wake you up, Mr. Moose, but we've got to get this maple syrup to Flapjack Falls. Maybe you can join us for some yummy pancakes? Mm -hmm. Yeah! All aboard! Justin, are we there yet? Not yet, Squidgy. It looks like something else is blocking our way. It's a tree! Stop the tree! <gasps> Let's go take a closer look. <gasps> Whoa! This tree is humongous! How are we gonna move it? What's that noise? It's coming from over there. <gasps> Look at all this sawdust. I wonder who cut down this tree. Look, someone's cutting down another one. Hello! It's a beaver. They're always chewing on trees. Hey, that gives me an idea. You're really good at chomping on trees, Mr. Beaver. <laughs> Could you please chomp through this tree? It's blocking our way. <laughs> oh, he said he'd be happy to help. Great! Mm. Wow, thanks, Mr. Beaver. That was some chomping. Hey, do you want to chomp on some pancakes, too? Yeah, you should come to Flapjack Falls with us. We're going to the Pancake Festival. <laughs> uh -huh. He says he loves pancakes. Great, but we'd better tidy up first. Let's put that wood away on the train. We did it! If we hurry, we can still make it to the Pancake Festival. Hey, everyone. I can see smoke up ahead. That's the smoke from the pancake griddle. We're almost at Flapjack Falls. All aboard! Huh? Hey, why isn't the train moving? Maybe it needs more coal. Oh no, we're out of coal. Oh, we're really stuck now. It's okay, everyone. We're not going to miss the Pancake Festival. We've gotten this far, and we're not gonna give up now. Right, there's a Pancake Festival that needs my maple syrup. Yeah, and there's a pile of yummy pancakes that belong in my tummy.
Thanks to you, Justin. Yay, yeah. Justin! These pancakes need some maple syrup, Olive. You do the honors, Justin. Really? Thanks, Olive. Let the Pancake Festival begin! Mm -hmm. Justin, breakfast is ready. Well, looks like it's time to go. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. And thanks again. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> ah. Bye! Again. How? With my lucky penny. <gasps> A lucky penny? Wow! Watch this. <gasps> awesome! Justin, it's your favorite, pancakes. Oh, boy! Hey, Justin, how do you know when a train is eating? You can hear it choo-choo. <laughs> choo-choo! <laughs> Tricky train track. Chugga 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 choo choo. Oh, can I ride Justin? You bet, Squidgy. All aboard the Justin Express. Woot woot. Hey, the lights just went out. Are you okay, Justin? I'm fine, Mom. I'm not scared of the dark. Oh, good. The lights might be out for a while, though. Good thing we've got these candles. Can you bring them to the living room for me? Okay. Thanks, honey. Here, why don't you take this? I'll be in in a minute. Come on, Squidgy. We've got a special delivery to make, and nothing's gonna stop us! <laughs> train, Olive? It is. I'm a conductor, and we're taking this cargo all the way up this big mountain to the town of Darjeeling. Wow, what's going on up there? Tonight is Diwali, the Festival of Lights. We love festivals. festivals! And lights. Well, Diwali's the best. It starts tonight, so we need to make our deliveries before the sun sets. But here's the thing. I don't have a driver for today. We're train drivers! Maybe we can help? That's great! Diwali can't start until we make these deliveries, so we better get going. No problemo. We'll make it in no time. Come on! But be careful. This mountain is steep, and it can get tricky. No problem, Olive. Driving trains is easy. Not even that giant boulder can stop Justin. Giant, giant boulder? boulder? Whoa, hit the brakes! Whoa, this boulder is huge! Heavy! Ugh. Oh no, we have deliveries to make. Don't worry, Olive. We'll think of something. Hey, maybe we could use that pointy thing to push this boulder. The cow catcher? Good idea, Justin. We're catching a cow? Oh, I've always wanted my own cow. And I, wait, what about the boulder? <laughs> no, Squidgy. It's just called a cow catcher. We use it to push things off the track. Oh, yes. <laughs> I knew that. Come on, we're not going to let this big boulder stop us. Track. Got it. Um, how do we turn, Olive? 
We just need to flip that switch up ahead. Oh, I can do that. <laughs> switch is flipped. Okay, we're pulling into the station. You can stop here, Justin. I'll go detach the boxcar. broken bridge stop us. We'll just have to fix it. I know. We'll use this crane. Right. We have new tracks on the cargo cart, too. I'll take care of this, Olive. Okay. Lowering the hook. going to stop us, remember? But we're still only halfway around the twisty curvy loop. I know. What if we make our train shorter? <gasps> we're going to shrink the train? <laughs> I think Justin means we'll leave some of the cars behind. We could leave the crane back at the second station. Good idea. That'll make the train way lighter. Come on, let's go. on the main track, so we'll need to do a lot of switching. Oh, oh, I'm good at switching. We did it! We 
cargo, Olive. Yeah, what is it? What is it? I'll show you. Ooh. These are called dias. They're special lamps that you light just for Diwali. <gasps> and Diwali is the festival of lights. That's right. Now let's unload these dias and help set them up. the Diaz, Diwali wouldn't be the same without them. You're welcome, Olive. I knew we could do it. Justin! That's Mom. Gotta go. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. See you, Squidgy. Bye. Wow. Thanks for the special delivery, Justin. You're welcome. Hey, why don't we read a book until the power comes back on? Yeah! Wouldn't give up. Chili Chopper Rescue. Ready for our first rescue, Squidgy? I'm ready, rescue pilot Justin. Okay, hang in there, Mr. Moose. Now let's get you back to solid ground. Great rescue, Justin. Phew! Rescuing is hard work. <gasps> no! Mumu Bear! Mumu Bear! I can't reach him! Is Mumu Bear stuck? Don't worry, Squidgy. I'll get him out of there. <gasps> Do you need help, Justin? It's okay, Squidgy. I've got it. I can rescue anyone, anytime, anywhere. Can you rescue a kitten from a tree? Who's better than me? A pretty bird in a little nest? I'm better than the best. A baby goat on the tallest hill. If no one can, you know I will. Wow. Do you like my rescue helicopter? Olive! Hi, Justin. Hey, Squidgy. Welcome to Northern Canada. Are you a rescue pilot, Olive? I am. Can you fly those helicopters? Yep. We don't have any roads or runways around here, so I fly a helicopter instead of a plane. I can't keep up with all the rescue calls by myself. I could really use some help. Well, Justin's the best rescue pilot around. I am. <gasps> That's an emergency call. Come on. Justin Olive and Squidgy's Air Rescue Service, we are ready to fly. We'll be right there, over and out. Kaya the husky pup is stranded on Mount Flattop. <sighs> I'm so busy today. If I go rescue that pup, I might miss another emergency call. Rescue pilot Justin reporting for duty. And rescue call pilot Squidgy! Great! You two can do this rescue. I'll stay here and give you directions over the radio. Just let me know if you need any help. Thanks, Olive, but I won't need any help. I'm the best rescue pilot in the whole world! Can you hear me, Justin? Loud and clear, Olive. Great! Is your seatbelt buckled? Check. Engine on? Engine on. Then you are clear for takeoff. Uh, there's no room to take off, Justin. No problemo, Squidgy. With the helicopter, there's always room. That's right. Helicopters can fly straight up. Like this. Let's go find Kaya! Coming up on Mount Slaptop. Hang on, Kaya! We're coming to get you! Where do we land, Justin? No problemo. Going down. Kaya, safe and sound, Olive. Great. Now let's get her home. You bet. Up we go. Good girl. I'll 
make sure Kaya gets back to her owner. Nice rescue, you two. We want to go again. Yeah, rescuing is fun. <laughs> we have another rescue mission. Lumberjack Bill forgot his lunch. That is an emergency. Nobody wants to see a hungry lumberjack. Luckily, I have a spare right here. Let's go, Squidgy. Good luck. And let me know if you need any help. Thanks, Olive. I'll be okay. To the rescue! Look, Squidgy. That smoke must be coming from the lumberjack's cabin. But there's nowhere to land. That's right. You'll need to use the winch to lower the lunchbox to the lumberjack. Use the lunch to lower the winch box with the, uh... Oh, okay. Lunchbox in position, Olive. Going down. Why, thank you. You're welcome! Olive, the lunchbox is delivered. Great job, Justin and Squidgy. But I just got another call about a really big rescue. A baby seal is stuck on an ice floe drifting out to sea. Sounds like another job for rescue pilot Justin. This one is going to be tricky and dangerous. I've been making rescues all day. How hard can it be? Okay, but let me know if you need any help. Thanks, Ollie. We're coming, baby seal! Whoa, look at those huge pieces of ice. Those are ice floes. The seal is stuck on one of them. I'll keep an eye out for him. <gasps> Justin, I think I see the seal pup. Going in for a closer look. We've come to rescue you, little pup. Do you have enough room to land, Justin? No problemo, Squidgy. You did it! Great landing, Justin. Thanks, Olive. I'm going to rescue the baby seal. Be careful. Ice flows can break up very easily. No worries, Olive. I've got this. Come on, little guy. It's okay. He's too scared. I guess I'll have to go get him. Careful where you stop, Justin. One wrong move and the ice can crack. No worries. I've got this. for help this time. What is that? Justin, are you okay? Olive, I am now that you're here. But Justin, I can't land. The ice floe is too small. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry, Justin. All I can do is winch. Wait, that's it. The winch! Olive, fly over and get Squidgy's winch line. Then bring it to me. Squidgy, you can tow my ice roll back to you. Great idea, Justin. We're coming to get you! Here it comes, Squidgy. Got it! Good to go, Olive. Take it to Justin. Okay, Justin, I'm on my way. Almost. Got it! Okay, Squidgy, pull us in. Pulling away! <gasps> it's working! Yes! Time to go, little guy. Oh, 
You're welcome. But it was Justin who really saved you. No, Squidgy. I couldn't have done it without you and Olive. You're the best co-pilot in the whole world. Aw, Justin. Squidgy, I need you to pull back on that lever. This one? Okay. Okay, Olive, let's head back to base. Race you there. On your mark, get set, go! Right, little guy. You should be safe here. There's no ice flows around. Bye-bye, little seal. That was a tricky rescue, Justin. Sorry you had to rescue me, too. That's okay. It's what I do. Next time, I'll know when to ask for help. Justin! That's Mom. Time to go. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. See you later, Squidgy. is going to be really hard. I'm going to need your help, Co-Pilot Squidgy. Co-Pilot Squidgy reporting for duty! Hold on. It's going to be a tight squeeze. Keep lowering. Lower. Yep, lower. Oh, you're safe with us, Moo Moo Bear. <laughs> Bring us up, Rescue Pilot Justin. Okay, Squidgy. Going up. You did it, Justin! You saved Moo Moo Bear! We did it, Squidgy. I couldn't have done it without you. What's that, Moo Moo Bear? Oh, you're very welcome. It's what we do. <laughs> <laughs>